Unlocking the mystery of talent portion in English. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore a fascinating phrase, talent portion. This term might sound a bit mysterious at first, but don't worry. We're here to demystify it for you. So, let's dive in and discover what talent portion really means. The phrase, talent portion, is commonly used in the context of competitions, especially beauty pageants and talent shows. It refers to a segment of the competition where contestants showcase their unique skills or talents. This could be anything from singing, dancing, playing a musical instrument, to even performing magic tricks. The key aspect here is that participants are judged based on their individual talents. Interestingly, the term, talent portion, isn't widely used in everyday English. It's more of a specialized term, specific to the world of competitive events. Its origins are rooted in the tradition of pageants, where showcasing a range of skills was essential to stand out. Over time, it has become a staple in various talent-based competitions globally. Let's see how talent portion is used in sentences. 1. During the talent portion of the contest, she amazed the audience with her violin performance. 2. Contestants are now preparing for the talent portion, which is the most anticipated part of the show. These examples highlight how the phrase is typically employed in context, emphasizing its specific application in describing a part of a competition. Understanding phrases like, talent portion, is crucial for English learners, especially those interested in cultural and entertainment contexts. It enriches your vocabulary and helps you comprehend various English-speaking settings more effectively. Remember, every new term or phrase you learn opens up a new dimension of the language. And that's a wrap on, talent portion. We hope this video has shed light on this unique phrase and its usage in English. Remember, learning a language is all about discovering new words and their contexts. Keep exploring, and you'll find English is full of interesting phrases just like this one. Happy learning, and see you in our next video.